So what do we have to do? We gotta wash our hands. So friends. I'm working with Hannah at the Capital District Child Care Council, and what we do is we put on programs for preschool aged children to get them interested in nutrition. Sophia, what color do you think is on the inside? Orange. We try to start healthy habits at a young age so that it will last throughout their lifetime. We get them interested in food, and we think it's really important for young children to understand where their food comes from, um, and healthy habits at a young age is really important for us. Orange! It's orange! So what we're doing today is we're introducing cantaloupe to the children. Um, a lot of them have probably seen it, you know, cut up at mealtime. Instead, we're showing them the whole fruit. Um, we're getting them to taste it, to smell it, to, you know, observe it and give us their ideas about it. We're cutting it open, we're having them feel it, every aspect of it. And then what we're doing is we're showing them how to plant cantaloupe seed. So they're taking their little pot, they're putting the cantaloupe seed in there, they're covering it with soil, they're watering it, and then they're watching it grow in the classroom and they're getting used to watering it throughout the weeks while we're not here with their teachers. Pour it over the dirt, I'll help you a little bit. So our ultimate goal is to take the seeds that we grow in the classroom, um, that we plant each week with Miss Hannah, and we're gonna transfer them into our community garden. So when the seeds grow into the cantaloupe or green beans that we planted, they can then take them home or we could serve them at lunch. We help the center build gardens. So that could be container gardens or raised beds or whatever works for them. Um, that could also be improving existing gardens that they already have. And then the third part of it is bringing a farmer's market directly to the preschool center. So here's where we really try to reach the parents, the community members, and the staff and provide them access to healthy fruits and vegetables. From June until September, October, we partner with a local farmer and we bring them right to the preschool center. So we'll have a market going once a week, usually during pickup time so we can reach as many parents as possible. A big unit that we do with our three and four year olds is our community helpers. So one of the community helpers is a farmer. So learning about this helps them to understand what a farmer does every day and understand how our food gets on our table every single day at lunch. Friends, do you want another seed? Yeah. In order to pr promote good nutrition and physical activity, um, any food exploration activities like the ones you saw are great. It's a great place to start and you can do it during your lunchtime and your snack time. So you don't have to bring in outside resources. Just starting a conversation around food with kids while they're eating. We're hopefully creating habits that'll last for the rest of their lives instead of trying to reverse potentially bad habits that develop down the line. So we're hoping to really set kids up for healthy eating behaviors and habits in the future and thus they'll live healthier lifestyles.